Those yellow buses rolled today for the first day of school in the state's largest school district, and there's still a lot of families trying to register for their kids for Columbus Public Schools. ABC6 reporter Luann Stoy is live at the district's enrollment center now with the latest. Luann? Well, Adam, they were handing out some cool drinks to quell some hot tempers here at the enrollment center today. Now we want to show you a little bit earlier. We uh, saw families coming in and out of the center in minutes because they had appointments, but others have been frustrated by not being able to sign up their children for classes. Drop-ins were not accepted today. This center is designed to be one-stop shopping for guardians, and the goal is to preserve data integrity. So for those who could not enroll their children, we're after the answers from the top school boss about what's next. No, they're not counted absent until they're actually registered as students in the district. And many of those families will take those children to the buildings today and will accommodate them. We don't turn away learners. And while the superintendent and mayor visited a number of schools across the district today, some parents told us they were turned away when they brought their children to class without first registering them. Dr. Dan Good says the district has made improvements over this last year, but still has some work to do. Good says he wants to work with parents to make sure they try to get kids signed up earlier. This enrollment center open year round. Right now, the Columbus City Schools enrollment topping 53,000. However, some of those students, well, they may with draw because they have actually moved from the district. For now, we're live in downtown Columbus, Luann Stoya, ABC6 News.